So let's quickly go over number three. Suppose x has a normal distribution with a mean of 50 and a standard deviation of 6. So the mean is 50, standard deviation is 6. In this case, it says about 68% of the x values lie within one standard deviation mean of the mean. What are the values? So we've got to figure out what um, one standard deviation of the mean is. Now, if we quickly draw normal distribution, let's say this is negative 1. And that's 1. So they want to know the x values that lie within one standard deviation of the mean. So we have to find this and this. So we're looking for when z is 1 and when z is negative 1. So we have to do 2 here. So we are going to do x equals, we're solving for x here, we're finding the x values. So remember x equals uh, the mean plus z times the standard deviation. So 50 plus uh, the first one we'll do is 1 times 6. 50 plus 6, 56. Now let's do it with negative 1. It's going to be 50 minus 6. It's going to be 44. Let's go. Here I'm going to so let's reference this. So let's pretend that this distribution right here is the one that we are talking about. The mean is at 50. So what we have just found is 50. What we've just said is that one standard deviation to the right is 56, and to the left is 44. So let's go ahead and do this two more times with the 95% and then the 99.7%. Now here, the Z value at 95% is 2, and z is negative 2. So 50 plus 2 times 6. 50 plus 12, 62. And then 50 plus negative 2 times 6 is 50 minus 12, which is 38. So that means this is Eight, and that is 62. All right, and then 99.7, that's when the standard, uh, the x values lie within three standard deviations. So z is 3 and z is negative 3. All right, so then we have 68 and 32. So that means 99.7% of the x values in this distribution are between 32 and 68. 95% are between 38 and 62, and 68% are between 44 and 56.